Good morning from Studio 57 here in New York. I'm Nikki Batiste. Yes, you are. Good to have you here with us. <laughs> it's so good to be here. A treat <laughs> so to be good. with you. Thank you. It's always great to be with you, Nikki. Uh, I'm Vladimir Dutte. Here's a look at the stories grabbing our attention right now. From witness to target, former Trump lawyer Rudy Giuliani is now a central focus of a criminal investigation over allegations of election interference in Georgia. The significance of this change ahead. And the Justice Department is trying to keep the affidavit supporting the search warrant for Mar-a-Lago confidential. We'll have new details about the direction of the investigation. A highly anticipated primary happening in Wyoming today as Republican Congresswoman Liz Cheney fights to keep her seat in Congress for following the race and the future of her political career. Plus, House Republicans on the Foreign Affairs Committee are set to release a report criticizing the U.S. withdrawal from Afghanistan. We'll speak with a congressional reporter about what to expect. And there is a lot going on in China, from newly imposed sanctions to punish the U.S. and Taiwan to a surprise rate cut. Uh, Lucy Kraft joins the screen to break it all down. Uh, lots going on today. A lot going very, on today. A lot of news. Yeah. So we're going to get right into it. Uh, we're following some major developments out of Georgia. A special grand jury there is investigating efforts by former President Trump and his allies to overturn the 2020 election results. Rudy Giuliani's legal team now says he is a target of the probe. Trump's former personal lawyer is expected to appear before the grand jury tomorrow. Another development involves South Carolina.